Hello YouTube friends and families, how are you guys doing? Hope you're doing great and today is um, Tuesday here in California and this is just my short intro for this vlog today. Um, our weekend vacation is not that long. We only stay there for a day in our boat and so that's why these following videos are just um, clips of some activities during the weekend and i uh, hope you like this video guys and stay tuned just making my hopia my own hopiang baboy but it's actually made of um caramelized onion sweet and caramelized onion it's not actually pork they just name it like that because it tastes like pork and that's the feeling that's the caramelized sweetened onion and this is the pastry okay two different kinds of dough that um, combine together to have a flaky texture so, press this like this press the dough like that and then flatten it and i use this once it's flattened i use this to have a nice round shape and that's it this batch is done now we will sprinkle some um, sesame seeds so i brushed it with milk milk and turmeric to achieve some yellow color or vibrant color so i decided to use tur turmeric okay I'm gonna use my air fryer and we will air fry this hopia for 10 minutes at 325 degrees Fahrenheit got some left here hey there YouTube friends and families yeah so I'm making this um traditional Filipino pastry and it has a super unique filling uh, made out of um, sweetened caramelized onion and it is really delicious something that's um, been um, I'm making this because I want to have something to take with me or to bring to our weekend vacation although it's gonna be a short weekend for us and it's gonna be um rainy and cloudy so i don't know if we're staying that long in the boat this weekend we will see like the first batch of our hope young baboy looking good And that same day, we went to Costco to grab a few items or, okay, so we returned a couple items and then we did some Amazon grocery shopping. Amazon fresh and orange for sale. Yeah. Ooh, I like this low carb tortilla. To finally get it. New Del Tacos. Before we headed to the boat, we had to drop off the Boston Whaler to have something done. And let's go to our weekend boatcation. Oh, but before the weekend vacation, we have to stop by at the dentist for my husband's dental implant. 4, 7 in the afternoon. We are here at Bahamarin because we're gonna look for some parts for the Mercury boat motor. And I'm just waiting in the coffee. Scruffy is right there, being all cute. Among book dito mga loves and mga pinapa-repair 
place very horrible. We made it to the marina and Scrubby is saying hi to a doggy friend. And our neighbors here, okay, so the following day we made our morning coffee and this is the hopia or the Filipino pastry that I made. And look at the weather guys, it's so gloomy, rainy and it's no fun. Bye bye. You go yung bye bye. And we just decided to just go home. Home na guys, cause it's been windy and nothing really much to do, and it's Sunday tomorrow, so we might as well get ready for church tomorrow. See how windy it is. I didn't show the wind in the bank of our phone, but it's it's windy. Fast forward, Sunday after church and this is already dinner time and I'm just showing you this uh, veggie lasagna that we got from Costco for $10 and this is what we're gonna have for dinner. minutes. This is how it looks like and we have to bake it for 20 minutes and it's done guys so let's eat dinner. Fast forward Monday, I have to make something that has vegetable because I'm craving vegetable. That's why I decided to make this pancit with lots of vegetables. And that way, I don't have to cook for a few days because I have this pancit. Once it is almost done, I'm just making sure that uh, um, noodles or the bihon and the pancit canton are soft enough. And then I added my uh, mixed vegetables with chicken. That's how it makes the pancit so yummy because of all the vegetables and all the seasonings. You can add pork, but I use chicken. And I'm also going to add some... Um, fish cake and some tofu because I love tofu guys yeah so it's done ready to eat dinner time and also my mother-in-law made some roast so she gave us some you know we have lots of food to last us forever <laughs> and that's what happened this past weekend it's not a short weekend vacation but at least i have something to share with you guys and thank you for watching thank for all the support all the comments and hopefully we'll see you on our next vlogs and that's it bye for now god bless love you all